Welcome. Let's get started. First, head over to Zindi and click on the Compete tab. From there, go to Practice Challenges, and I'm going to select the Financial Inclusion in Africa Challenge. Once you've read through all the information on the challenge page, click on the Data tab and download the entire archive. When the files have finished downloading them, you'll find them in your Downloads folder. Extract the contents of the archive. Inside, you'll see a manifest file, which you do not need, four data files, and a starter notebook. Next, we're going to open up our Google Drive. Here, we'll create a new folder with the name of the challenge, for example. We're going to add all the files here. Double click the starter notebook and it will open in Google Colab. Once Colab opens, click the connect button in the top right corner to start your runtime session. This might take a few seconds. At the top of the notebook, you'll see a brief description of what the notebook does. Scroll down to the tab that imports the libraries. Next, click on the folder icon on the left panel, then click mount drive and run the cell. Next, click on the folder icon on the left panel, then click Mount Drive and run the cell. You'll see a few pop-ups. Go ahead and accept them all to connect Google Colab to your drive. Now create a path variable. Go back to the drive folder, refresh, locate your challenge folder under your drive, once found, Right-click to copy the file path. Paste this path into your path variable, making sure to add a backslash at the end. Then update your co code to read each file using the path variable. This allows your notebook to load directly from your drive. You won't need to upload the files every time and run your notebook. They're already there. Scroll to the bottom of the notebook where you generate your submission file. Update the output path using the same path as above. So your submission gets saved in your drive folder. This way you'll never lose your first submission or any others that follow. Before making a submission to Zindi, please ensure that you've set your index to false. This ensures that you do not have any missing values when making a submission. Well done on connecting to your first Google Colab notebook. Good luck and happy competing.